kept getting injured running over and over again. I started to think after, after the fourth or fifth time I injured my same calf that maybe running wasn't for me. I came to Spalding for two reasons. One was to work with Irene Davis, and two was I knew they would train me on the four-foot straight and how to change my gait properly to that. I believe everybody's a runner. I think that running is in our genes. It's something that we are able to do without any kind of training at all. And it's something we need to do. It's an activity of daily living. You have to run after your kids. Rich was a great candidate for the program at Spalding. He was one of a group of runners who tried to transition themselves on their own. I worked as a strength coach at Sports and Conditioning facility in Rhode Island. I thought if I just did some calf raises and did some strengthening, I'd be fine. But I turned out coming here, there were so many other muscle imbalances I had and so many things that were out of whack that I needed a lot more help than just calf raises. There are three phases to the um, retraining program here at the Spalding National Running Center. Phase one is building the capacity and the strength to change your mechanics. Phase two is a four week, three times a week gait retraining program. And then phase three takes them outside into their natural environment where they increase their running gradually. The closer we are to the way that we were evolved to run and more naturally, I think the less risk we have for injury. And that's our philosophy. A lot of people don't think you need coaching to run because you just go outside and run, you've been doing it your whole life. But if you do it, want to do it a lot, do it consistently, you have to do it right. I'm proof of that. The research done within the Spalding Network is just amazing. The work that they do with head injuries, with spinal cord injuries, with burns, strokes, neurologic patients, musculoskeletal injuries are also very important. 50% of adults have musculoskeletal injuries. Movement matters. I think what was most important, I value the most from, from working with Irene and her team was their dedication and commitment to me and their belief that I could do it. Yeah, I think if I had the benefit of finding this place 15, 20 years ago, I think I'd be a much healthier person now. I think I'd be happier. Running makes me happy.